Hi everyone, I'm Giovanni Albani, CEO of Fuserwork. Thanks for joining me today. I'm incredibly excited to share some big news with you today. We are launching a new Blazor extension called Xamarin for Blazor. We have built this tool in response to a need we have noticed in the Blazor community. Here, for example, is an issue that was created in 2018 in the Blazor repository. We recognize that the developers who are used to crafting UIs with XAML sometimes find it challenging to adapt to Blazor's HTML and CSS Razor-based approach. So we have created Blazor, for example, to bridge the gap, making it easier for you to use your existing XAML skills within Blazor apps. What this means is that now you can use XAML side by side with Razor files. It's like having your cake and eating it too. You can mix and match, utilizing the best parts of both technologies in your projects. The magic behind XAML for Blazor is powered by OpenSilver, our open source re-implementation of Microsoft Civilite for the modern web. Here you can see a very complex application that was migrated from Civilite to OpenSilver. It uses Telerik, RIA services, it has a lot of complex XAML controls. On the left, it's running on Internet Explorer, on the right, it's running on Chrome, and of course, it can also run on Edge, Firefox, Safari, and all modern browsers on all platforms. There are so many use cases, for example, for Blazor. If you have a preference, for example, you can now easily leverage that within Blazor. Or if you are migrating from another XAML blazed application like WPF, Civilite, UWP, or WinUI, XAML for Blazor makes the process smoother. You can also leverage advanced controls like the data grid and the data form and enterprise-centric features like RIA services, WCF SOAP, Prism, MEF, and much more. Our goal with Xamarin for Blazor is not to replace Razor. We want to offer you more tools and more options so you can create the best web applications possible. We are already planning future announcements like Blazor server-side support, right now only Blazor WebAssembly is supported, more documentation and examples, and a UI designer. Now, let's dive into the Getting Started guide, shall we? All you need to get started is to reference the Xamarin for Blazor package from your Blazor WebAssembly project. To make things even easier, we have an optional Visual Studio extension, VSAX, that adds templates to the Add New Dialog window of Visual Studio. Then, you can add your Xamarin files to your Blazor project. Finally, you can reference your Xamarin files from within your Razor pages and components as shown here. Xamarin elements will render as HTML. Xamarin and Razor components will share the same DOM, the same memory and the same thread, so it's very easy to pass objects back and forth and to register events. You will find more details on the Xamarin for Blazor website. And that's it, you're up and running! Here you can see that we have added the Xamarin data grid and the data form to the usual Hello World Blazor application. On the Xamarin for Blazor website, you will find a step-by-step -step tutorial, the list of features and limitations, the link to a sample project on GitHub, pricing information, and much more. For any questions or inquiries, please do reach out to us. Thank you so much for joining me today. I cannot wait to see what you create with Xamarin for Blazor. Thanks again and happy coding.